Destiny, where is she? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? I want to believe that everybody is fine. So in today's video, I went to Hamas Market or Food Garden, like you call it here, and I wanted to show you guys um, the things I got. So I went to buy, I don't know, this is like the type of basket they sell now. I bought these tomatoes for 3000 It's two and a half custard in the measurement. Then I got this um, habanero for two five. Okay, this is it. That's the quantity. That's half custard, two five. And I bought this for seven hundred. This is your regular scotch bonnet. Okay. And then I bought chombo or chili. I bought this for I think one five for one custard. And then I bought cabbage. I bought this three cabbage. Though don't judge based on what I bought here today because <laughs> from the woman that sold it to me, she has always been my customer whenever I go to that woman's market. So she was very nice. She gave me this three uh, this three cabbage. That's this two and this one purple. This one usually they sell it for two thousand. So she gave me this three for one thousand. Okay. And then I bought carrot for five hundred. And then she gave me this one also for 600 because this was the last she had okay but usually this is up to um, 2000 or 15 or some or some, something there about but i got it for 600 she just gave it to me and also i got um sweet potato i got this sweet potato for 15 that's a custard okay so i just want to show you guys everything that i got so my plan is to prep this I'm going to blend all of this and I'm going to um, blend them and then I'm going to cook them down so I can store them okay so things are very expensive this day like the money I went to the market with after I finished buying everything I was like looking for my money maybe maybe I mistakenly dropped money somewhere or something but I actually bought everything I paid so this is um, for this perishable I'm going to show you other things I bought okay so over here guys, I got dry time, okay, I got this review pack, I think I got this for one, two, one, two, I also got um, white vinegar for washing fruits and, um, and vegetables, I got this for 500, I, I got flat seed, and this I got for 700, this is half a cup, okay. And then I got uh, chia seed. They measured this one from the 1,000, 1,000 naira. That's one cup. Okay. I also measured the um, cinnamon, cinnamon powder. This is also I think 1,000. So. I got um, mixed fruits, dried fruit. I got for 1,000 naira. And then I got um, seasoning powder. This is the pack I like to buy these days because it's easy for me to, to use. You don't have to be opening, opening, opening. But I used to buy that one also. But when I buy it, I like to open it at once and turn it into powder. So if you watch my recipe, I use more of seasoning powder these days than seasoning cube. So I bought this too. I think I bought this for several, several hundred. So I bought two of this size. And then I bought them. Um, Curry powder for the few. I think this I got for 1000 1000 for this 250 grams. I also bought um, um, tiger curry. I love this tiger curry. Um, they just convinced me in the market to take this one, that is very good. So I'm just going to try this one. But this is the one I know, okay, right from time. So I also bought it. This is for 400. I also bought um, rosemary, okay, for 400 or so. Then I got um, seasoning powder also. I got the roll. I think this roll is 3,000. It is 10, 10 pieces in the roll. 10 pieces like this in the roll. And then I got almond nuts because I want to make um, granola, the flaxseed and all of this good stuff. And then I got, um, I got um, cloves. Okay, so I use a lot of cloves. We use it for, I use it to, for Zobo and the steam bath, okay, it just amplifies the flavors of um, your, your Zobo. I also use it for steam bath, 
okay and for other things okay it also helps to um keep the weevils away from things like your uh, beans and all those uh, grains okay so it's very important it's, it's always very important to have okay yeah so i got this grape it's a red grape as you can see i just bought it because i want to juice it so i got this for I don't know the woman was on my neck you know when you when you get to food garden if you've never been to that market before if you buy things like tomatoes people will just be coming around there telling you wow madam can you buy avocado buy lemon buy pear buy fish buy all those things so i didn't plan to buy it but the woman was like begging me i should buy and i saw that maybe <laughs> i just bought it so she gave me all this thing for 500 but she told me that that she's supposed to sell it for 800 but that she wants to open market so I bought it for 500 so I'm going to use it for a recipe and then I bought um, um, lettuce because I want to make um, salad with it so this is what I got I'm going to be keeping them is a lot and they showed me how you can preserve it just put it in the fridge the um, crispy part of your fridge or you can just keep it outside every day just dip it in water it will, it will stay for a while okay so but it is advisable that you use it as soon as you can okay so this is for this all right i think there are other things missing let me show you okay. i also got um custard drop of um, onion and i got this custard um one custard for two thousand naira okay is then um, still old onion in case you go to the market there is new onion and there is old onion so this old one is more expensive than the new one like i heard that they're selling the new one for like one five okay but i bought this one for two thousand and when you're buying your onion ensure that you check it well okay ensure that you're pressing it and no one is soft so that since you're going to be storing it it's not going to spoil quickly on you and what i'm going to be doing with this onion i'm going to be blending some I'm going to be storing in my fridge and then I'm going to be pickling some okay that's what I'm going to do and then I'm going to drop some just to leave it there and then I bought um, I bought honey beans this is honey beans one cost and this is for my father okay but this one for my father okay so when you want to buy your beans also check it okay so that you don't buy beans that you will store and the beans already have weevil so look at the beans see how clean the beans is and if you happen to because we're talking about storing of food if you happen to buy beans and you find out that there is weevil in your beans please take it outside on a very sunny day spread it out on a mat or something because of the heat of the sun they will leave the beans and then when you now pour it in your container have things like clothes and babies into your beans or maybe you're saying things like even rice okay there are rice wheels and all of that so store it properly there you can store it in your freezer if you keep your beans in your freezer you know you don't need clothes you don't need um, babies but if you're storing it just in your container in the kitchen or in the pantry make sure you add clothes to it it helps to build it okay so guys this is all the things i got from the farmer's market today or the things i got i'm still buying things like canned food meat like fish and all of that i want to carry you guys along as i do go ahead now and start prepping everything like i told you maybe i'll show you the process and